Um, hi guys, and um, well, welcome back to another episode of Fine Foods Food Review, the show for food lovers and eaters alike. Uh, now, I know it's been quite a while since I um, put out an episode last, but I'm, I'm back now, and I'm back for good. So, um, this is Season 2 of Fine Foods Food Review. Um, I'm going to be taking this season very seriously. I'm, I, I think I'll be uploading a video every week, probably on a Wednesday. And, and now I'm going to show you the, um, the food that I'm going to eat. And I thought, <laughs> what, what better way to start off Season 2 than going back to my roots? And what are my roots? Well, let, let me tell you, it's noodles. I really enjoy eating noodles, and this is a, a very new noodle that I've never tried before. So, if you can see, it's called Neoguri, which is a Korean noodle. You can see that from the Korean characters there. And what, what Neoguri means is is new noodle, because neo means new, and guri means noodle. And the reason these are called new noodles is because um, when when um, Kim Jong Un came into power in South Korea, um, he didn't like the way they made old noodles, and then he decided to change the recipe. So now, now we have new noodles. And that's what I'm eating. So, I'm just going to take a look at its spicy seafood flavour. And um, that's very typical of Korea because, um, because when the new noodles came into place, um, they tasted better with seafood because um, Korea is a, a fishing town and um, they, they, mo most of their produce is actually fish and particularly seafood fish. So I'm going to go in and have my first taste of these new Korean noodles. Okay, so um, so those those were a lot softer than I thought they were going to be, and that that's actually kind of taken me aback because the the old noodles in in Korea had had more of a chewy consistency, whereas these are very soft and they sort of melt in your mouth, and and, and that texture actually um kind of distracted me from the flavour. So I'm go I'm going to go in for a second bite, and and we'll see if I can identify any of the key flavours and ingredients in this in this traditional Korean dish. Okay, so I can definitely taste the um the the seafood flavour. I think it tastes a little bit like squid. There's a bit of seaweed in in there, and although it says spicy, it's actually quite quite mild. And um, of, of all the noodles that I've eaten, this is maybe the maybe the seventh least spicy off the top of my head. But I'll have to consult my official list and get back to you on that. Um, but uh, uh, overall, the flavour is very nice, but I was very disappointed with maybe the consistency and the, um, <clears throat> the level of spice. Though perhaps maybe it was meant to be more spicy, but I'll, I'll show you a little clip here, because um, when when I got the, the the powder, it actually came out as a solid block, and I don't think that they were meant to do that. So maybe that's just an issue with the new noodle recipe. But um But yeah, I think they tasted 
quite nice and they're very easy to make you just pour in water and then you can eat it straight up and that's why I'm giving it a 6 out of 10 um, come back next week when I will be eating some food okay um, goodbye and like and subscribe and also comment what food you want me to eat okay goodbye